Rob, rob tail on the track. Uh, 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 uh. Hop in the whip and I hit these switches. See that chrome suspension. Uh, Look at the car, you know who did it. I don't have to mention. Uh, uh, they know it's Alex from Hoppos, 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 Hoppos. Uh, uh, Custom work come from Hoppos, Hoppos, Hoppos. I'm, I'm Rob Tell of 504. For anybody that gotta know, Alex stay with fresh content and he keep it coming like a slideshow. Never cut corners far as I know, but he cut metal with his eyes closed. Control arms, reinforced frame, still killing the game. You see the gun smoke from Impalas with the X frame, doing tricks like he came from the X game. Everybody gotta tune in. What's up and good morning guys, how are you? Alex here from Hot Bowls with another video for you guys. As you guys saw by a little intro there, we had tons and tons going on. We got wishbones being built, we got wide bones being built, we got frame kits being cut. And speaking of frame kits, we got those now ready to ship out. Those are two right there, the other one's somewhere over there. Um, by the time you guys are watching this video, those will already be live on the website, along with something I actually haven't listed yet. Let me take you guys over there. 58 to 64 wish or drive line, sorry, 50 to 64 drive lines. Already machine bounced with the slip, ready to drop in 58 to 64 Impala only. Guys, I repeat, no, this will not fit a Cutlass, no, this will not fit a G body, no, this will not fit a Cadillac. 58 to 64 is the only one that we do because it's a two piece, it's our back half. Good for up to 12 inch cylinders, already machine bounce, ready to go. There's the bouncing weights, ready to drop in the car and go. No, this will not work if you have. Extended trailing arms that are eight inches long and your rear ends touching your back bumper. No, I repeat no I'm not saying that to be like an a-hole, but I literally post what it's for in the comments I'm on IG and people will be like hey, I got a go-kart on 46s that are tucking Can that fit? I'm like Guys, it's on the comments or it's in the description. All right, just read it click the little read more button It's on there we do that to make things easier and to eliminate the hassle of going back and forth through DMs. It's already listed, it's on the website. You guys need parts, jump on the website. It makes it quick and easy for everybody. And well, things have been interesting here because we've been a limited staff once again, but we were making things work here. And let me get by here. It's crazy how uh, such a big warehouse shrunk really, really fast. Um, we're just bringing in so much more you know, product, material, getting stuff ready to cut. Natalie's been busy here. Blocks galore. She's already eliminated like five or six carts. And well, look at that, fresh. Fresh, fresh, fresh. And while you guys have been keeping Nelly busy, blocks, backing plates. There you guys go. There's no funny business here. You got blocks, backing plates, US made. Again, we're just keeping Natalie busy over here, huh? <laughs> and while on the other side of the shop, we have uh, Vic doing nothing. A again? You forgot to pay the Pornhub account again? Yeah. <laughs> so guys, we're getting the shipping out right now. Um, I'm a little behind because I had to do some parts runs this morning, but Vix managed to get all this going. Oh my God. Vix managed to get all this going here. And uh, well, um, I don't know if you saw it, but the counter's full. We got like 40 more orders. Really? Yeah, I told you. Vic, we love each other. All right? Just let the YouTube world know. Just kidding, guys. And as far as another update, I guess uh, people are really curious about uh, Vic's daughter and my daughter. They are both doing good. They are both healthy. Uh, mamas are doing good. They're working, healthy, got the baby. So uh, things have been good. Uh, you know, 2020 was a busy year for us uh, with the shop move, with my house move. I got married, had the baby. Vic had his baby. I mean, we got a lot of stuff going on. So. Thank you guys for always liking and sharing and supporting. If you guys are new to the channel, obviously, just like every YouTuber says, hit the like and subscribe button. Please, pay my bills. I need my 0.2 cents per click. Thank you, I appreciate that. Thank <laughs> you. 
pain like they the rain. Go down with it and watch his jump. Well guys, we are back here for another day, and well, another busy one. Vic's already at it, we got a delivery outside. I thought for sure he was gonna hit me right now. So we're expecting like two or three deliveries today. We have material and plate being delivered since we just burned through all last of our 30 sheets we had. We have a restock order coming in right now. Then we have a whole bunch of pallets going out actually too. We got two pallets going out right here. These are already all set, ready to go. What oh, happened there? Um, all set, ready to go. These are gonna be shipping out today. We also got another pallet going out right there. So we got three orders going out. I already set the FedEx uh, freight truck to come pick them up today. I scheduled that. So today's gonna be a busy, busy day for us again. Once again, Nelly's back on blocks, back on black, uh, backing plates, ba backing plates. It's too early, Jesus. I only had one coffee so far, guys, so bear with me. No Red Bulls in my system yet. Today's gonna be a rough day. I need to get a Red Bull in my system. I need to get sponsored by Red Bull or something. Here, get a freaking Red Bull refrigerator in here, like a 7-Eleven. That'd be nice. Well, guys, it looks like FedEx Freight has arrived. We got a Z-Rack going out right there. Then we got these two going out as well, so. Three more orders down, three more big orders down, and uh, we got a lot more to go. So, here we go, let's get at it. Well, we got ourselves a Red Bull. We are trying to get going here. Que onda, mija? What now, Alec? What now? Doesn't it, doesn't it, when Vic talks? <laughs> when Vic talks, and it's like it's fucking scripted. So we got lower trailing arm for what vehicle? G-Body. G-Body. And we're cutting them, why? Because somebody was out of stock on them and forgot to cut them, huh? And we got tons of orders and we're searching for material. Thank God Vic came to the rescue. Thank God Vic came to the rescue. <laughs> yeah, yeah, see, yeah. You're blowing, you're blowing your shot too soon. So up next on the cho chopping block, man, I cannot talk today. <laughs> up next on the chopping block, ah, tired guys, tired. So we got tons and tons of trailing arms that we gotta do. Uh, we gotta get these up on the website. So again, you guys are watching this. This is already live. Again, we filmed this normally a week prior to what you guys are watching because by the time I edit it, it takes me a while. So we're getting a whole bunch of trailing arms up. Uh, G-Body uppers, G-Body lowers, uh, and G-Body drop downs. Those are the three that we're focusing on today. And uh, I got first batch tigged up yesterday. Actually, I shouldn't even say batch. First set ticked up yesterday. Um, we're just checking, make sure everything was good, make sure we had all our measurements right, because uh, our little bucket system here was kind of getting out of whack since we moved, and we had stuff mislabeled, and we were trying to make sure everything was right. So we had everything uh, lined up for a few sets right here. Uh, once I get a few sets, then we're gonna bring another cart in here and do a few more sets. But on a real note, Vic, a lot of people are actually asking about your baby. They want to know how she's doing. No, she's going strong, guys. <laughs> Hopefully, she talks more than her father does. <laughs> oh, <please. laughs> Why do you get nervous to put the hands out? All right, Ali, get the word. I swear, this guy hates the camera on him. I swear. All day, all day. Hey, somebody gotta keep you employed. I didn't think that was funny. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this guy, seriously. Uh, yeah, let's get welding here.
Vic's busy on this side of the curtain, and I'm on, side, on that side. Getting a whole bunch of wishbones tacked up, ready for me. Uh, he's prepping them, he's on a roll right now, like you said. I said, hey, Vic, you wanna, you, you wanna, you wanna, what are they gonna say? You, you want a Red Bull? <laughs> you wanna, you wanna Red Bull, Vic? He's like, nah, I'm on a roll right now, I don't need one. Obviously, I walk over here, he is on a roll, so. He's done a lot more than me, I'll tell you. I got a few done so far. I just kind of did a little time lapse for you guys. They're gonna get some more going right now. Oh. I need a Red Bull. Bad. So with everything going on right now, we got wishbones, Y bones, and uh, G body trailer arms, drop downs, and G body lowers as well. Now we're also doing G body frame kits. Now uh, we got a whole bunch going on. Uh, the guys are just at lunch right now, but the good part is we just got a delivery in right now for something that we've been waiting for. A little unexpected because it wasn't supposed to show up the next week, but it showed up early. So definitely excited for this right now finally able to put up a little signage uh, on the building itself <laughs> all right you got me you got me because over here playing hide and seek right now in the shop so with our new delivery excited because we get to finally put up some signage on the building which we haven't had you know since we moved in so now that that's in we're just gathering all the supplies that we need to get it up we're gonna we got two of them, so we're gonna go start on the easiest one first, and then we're gonna work our way to the hardest one. So, we gotta get everything together real quick, and gotta shoot up to the roof. It's like coming from the underground tunnels in Mexico, huh? Hell yeah. El Chapo didn't build this though. Thomas probably did. Who's fucking Thomas? I don't know. Thomas Edison? Thomas Edison. So, guys, we made it to the top of the roof. Drill. Oh, Careful, careful. All right, so we made it up. Got the banner with us. We got everything we need. Gotta get this guy hung up. There. You finally got one? Finally. Vic couldn't find the hole. Three out of six. Only on the top side. <laughs> we still got 20 more to go. We're tired. <laughs> this is why we don't work with concrete, we work with metal. Metal, I just pop a hole in it real quick with the plasma. I need a plasma for concrete, this shit sucks. <laughs> Gotta put a few more anchors in on the bottom side. Since Vic didn't want to do it, I have to come up here. Cause he's scared of heights. It is a nice view though, gotta say. And of course, the drill bit's burnt out. It's a 5.30 seconds, a weird size, especially for a concrete drill bit. So, I'm stuck up here right now while Vic's looking for a new one, which I doubt that we have. He thinks we have it, but I don't think we have it. Quarter inch, you can find here all day. 5.30 seconds in a concrete drill bit. Small shank, and uh, I'm tired. I'm freaking winded right now because this thing's kicking my butt, seriously. Nice size, not too big, not too small. I think it's perfect sizing for this building. A little high up here. Don't look too bad, but I mean, I got nothing but time up here right now since we're waiting on Vic.
All right, finished. I'll tell you what, <laughs> that was harder work than what we do on a normal day. I, str I struggled, I don't know, Vic struggled a little bit too, but I struggled on this freaking thing. But we got one up, and it's funny because that's what, a 18 foot banner or 16 foot banner? And it looks small up there. It's 16 by, I don't even know what it is. Yeah, it's a big banner, but when you put it alongside the, the whole building, it looks small. Uh, we do have another one we gotta toss up there, but before that, we are gonna go get a 5.30 seconds on the hammer drill because doing it on the regular drill, it just wasn't doing it. Our Makitas are holding up to it. The drill bits weren't holding up to it though. So it is way past go home time. Time to go. We are tired. Once again, guys, thank you guys for always watching. Thank you for always liking. Thank you for following us along this journey of the new shop. Appreciate it. You guys have a great one. I'm out.